Okay, I think we've constructed... So we've got a nice little empire going now. I'm gonna build an another outpost... Oh, we don't need to build our outpost at the black hole. We can just go ahead and build a research station. That's exactly what I want. I want a research station there. I want... Construction to complete. build mining stations in Backwardale. Updated. So we'll do that. Hi, so Wales. Fancy in the game? Yeah, it's it's pretty good. And we've got Kerbals. There's a lot of good modding already going on for this game. Okay, the Cybrex. We have discovered we have recovered artifacts from an ancient alien civilization on Palomar 7A. Incredibly, the civilization, which apparently referred to itself as the Cybrex seems to have been made up of machines that were linked together in some sort of collective consciousness. The age of the artifacts indicates that they were active some 600,000 years ago, in this portion of the galaxy at least, but we have learned nothing of their exact origins. According to a partial data fragment that our scientists managed to extract from one of the artifacts, the Cybrex at some point launched a crusade to destroy all sentient organic life in the galaxy for reasons unknown. I don't think I'd say Situation interesting, but okay. We need to move that guy on from At uh, Atmel's surveyed. Rim is still dangerous. Let's survey this one. The first fleet, okay, has destroyed that enemy. Now, these two are relatively close together, but let's go for it. Research complete. We have an Situation improved spaceport. Updated. So we can build destroyers. We need to research destroyers. Actually, that guy, well, he's already working on something that uses Voidcraft, so I guess we'll just go with this. At least Gene Kerman is a genius, and research speed is plus 10% thanks to that. Okay, so let's upgrade our spaceport here. Build, not, uh, yeah, spaceport upgrade, that's what I want. Uh, fleet combat stats, okay. Looks like we... Wow, our hit ratio is 100% against the crystalline entity. Okay, last one, and then we can finally send ships in here. It's right on the border of our territory, so that's good. Because we definitely want to try and colonize that if it's got good systems. We can't check right now. Well, let's research the Kappa aliens. Gotta do that. We need to find Cybrex artifacts. Oh boy. Space amoeba. We don't know where they're going. So Dangle... We wanted to rename that, did we? We very renamed Dangle 4 in particular, but we can rename the system... Situation log updated. Uh... Well, new Kerbal. Let's see if all the plant names change as a result. Yeah, they do. Very good. Except for the one that we specifically named, which is good. Okay, so I believe we've cleared this area of bad guys. This one's almost done with this system. This one is a little bit further from being done. So this science ship we will send over to Reem. System survey complete. So we've got a research station around the black hole, that's excellent. Let's head back over to New Kerbal and build... Wow, that's got to take all of our stuff. So let's not do that. Let's be more selective about where we put our mining stations for now. Uh, this one is lucrative. Okay, let's, let's build a mining station around Kubu. Okay, void clouds. An investigation into peculiar clusters of debris and space dust has yielded surprising results. It is a particular cloud bristling with a powerful charge of unknown origin that has no business exhibiting simple reflexive actions, let alone movements with a purpose, and yet it does. There is something undeniably ominous about a, the hazy subject of the relayed video feeds. Perhaps there are things in the universe we should not tangle with. Oh well, we only have that Situation choice. I think Kerbals would definitely updated. interfere. Haven't been looking for mods yet? Well, I did. I, I initially started out looking for one mod which gave you more color options. They didn't have the color white on the flag options, and so I specifically wanted a mod that would give me more color options, and I found one. Uh, so that was good. And also some more icon options, so, you know, cosmetic stuff. 
But then I found out that they've been modding it like crazy and have even a Kerbal mod already. Which has uh, custom names by the way, so like, taking a look at our first fleet, we've got Gilly 13, Kerman 5, Danlock Kerman, you know, I mean, we've got all the names down pretty well. Okay, Palmar system has been fully surveyed, okay. Now, we, we saw bad guys here. We should definitely try and lay claim to Akmal. Rim. Okay, so sign ship. Who, oh, that's our fleet. You're right, sign ship at Surma needed to go to Rim. You were in your second game, and how are you doing? Uh, what kind of population do you have? We've we've we're, we've only got two worlds and uh, wait, um, planets. Two worlds. Those are planet size. Looks like 11 population. Okay, so, um, let's build some stuff. Uh, that wouldn't be any good. Hy hydroponics farm would uh, produce extra food. That's, that's a good idea. Build mining station. 20 planets, 224 population. Oh boy, genetic modification. Oh darn, I haven't got new physics, uh, new, uh... Anomaly found. Oh, that, that's because of all, all these pop-ups. By chance, we stumbled upon a faint alien signal during the survey of the planet. The source appears to be a small object in orbit. The signal contains no message. Could it be a distress transponder? Another one of these. Okay, research that. Um, physics lab is good. Solar panel network. Um, energy credits is good. Okay, let's do that. Um... Monthly influence I want, and we want planetary capital as well. Okay. We really need energy credits. Uh, actually, construction ship, I'm gonna change your order. Figar. We can get two more from this one. Little mining station there. Okay. Well, this is our current situation. We've got the Kerbal Space Program here. Felnol United Systems. These guys are our sworn rivals. So we have to take their, them pretty seriously. I think we should have a frontier outpost at Akmail. The mummified remains of a single individual belonging to a previously unknown mammalian species have been found drifting in high orbit over Rim 1, being dressed in what appears to be a flight suit. Um, Maybe a fighter pilot that ejected in some ancient battle, only to be forgotten and left behind. Our study of the corpse has provide, provided uh, 60 so sociological research. Okay. Construction complete. So that I'll speed hostile this up. Fleet detected. Uh oh, hostile fleet detected. Uh, they are space amoeba again. I guess we'll leave the space amoeba alone now. So we've got the second fleet here. I guess we can recruit a new. Admiral. Um, hull point. I like uh, I like good hull points. Lisa Kerman then, because we're more defensive than offensive. Still losing energy credits. Now eventually we'll hit upon our directly controlled planet limit, but we're nowhere near there yet. I haven't found many habitable planets, honestly. That doesn't look particularly appetizing. Toxic world. No, that's not going to be good. This one is only habitable with Arctic colonization. So, uh, Lyseria is a place where we found space amoeba. I'm going to send our fleet over there to see if they're still uh, hanging out. Because we haven't actually surveyed it yet because we had to run away. Okay, Vacrodil has... I mean, that has been done. Okay, good. So, where can we send construction ships now? Probably to Reem. Um, just, just, uh, oh, well, let's take a closer look. Um, that will give us science. But we really need energy credits, so let's start building mining station there. So let's build some more ships, even though it's gonna cost maintenance. How much? We've got 6.5 ship maintenance and energy credits. Well, it's a very complex game. You, you need to get into the rhythm of it. Once you get into the rhythm of it, it's fine. 
limitless customization? Well, obviously. We're, we've already got Kerbals in. <laughs> uh, what we need is Kerbal-like ships, Aranem. Uh, we, we need our ships to look like Kerbal ships. We also need, you know, I've, I mentioned to other people, you know, Star Trek, Star Wars, to the other viewers. Um, I want EVE Online ships, you know, all that sort of thing, too. Okay, but it'll take some good modelers to do that, but considering how quickly they've already gotten mods in, I'm hopeful. Okay, let's uh, get Leif 8 class Corvettes as well as Gecko class Corvettes. The Leif 8 class has better weaponry, right? We have to drop one small nuclear weapon. Birth of space piracy. Certain irrational and criminal elements of our society have left Kerbin to seek an outlaw's life in the far reaches of space. In display of surprising ingenuity, these brigands have heavily fortified, oh, modified and weaponized a large number of civilian starships. Our civilian shipping lanes are now being raided by this improvised Starfleet, which identifies itself only as the Sons of the Night. A prompt resp response is needed. Yes, uh, so let's build some more ships. So now we've got those guys to deal with. Well, it, it should be easy to model Kerbal-like ships, right? Maybe. I don't know. Alright, where are these bad guys? That's our military. Um, that's Space Amoeba. I don't see uh, a fleet of space pirates. That's neutral fleet of beta aliens. Oh, they're still called beta aliens. We really need to research them. Yeah, research those guys. Hostile fleet detected. Oh wait, there the pirate fleet. Aha. Uh oh. Uh, well, they've got a little bit more power than our second fleet. Let's get our first fleet over here and our third fleet over here. Let's just combine forces here. And we'll see how long they hang out. The director of the Museum of Exobiology on Kerbin has issued a request for the procurement of several live alien specimens. These creatures were spotted on surveyed habitable worlds, but they are difficult to capture. It will require the full resources of a science ship for a lengthy, lengthy period of time. Well, obviously we'll try. Situation log updated. Okay, science is proceeding. Oh, they went out. Uh, where are they now? Oh, they're heading to Fegor. Okay. Yeah, uh, there is a mod for colonizing Mars. I don't know if it works with the update, because it was already a patch for the game. And it seems like it has a warning about it, because I downloaded it, obviously. But you can find it on Steam Workshop. I'm sort of shocked that they didn't make Mars colonizable in the first place as an arid world. They should have done that. Well, this is not going the way we would like here. The pirate fleet. Boblin Kerman is the commander of the pirate fleet. This is horrible. Yeah, yeah, well, I, we should all have a patch. Yeah. Otherwise, you'd get all sorts of stuttering here right now. Come on, we need reinforcements. No, Lisa Kerman's only got two ships left. Where are you guys? That says Fegar. Ah, oh, Lisa Kerman died. Ah, oh. they're horrible. Merge. No, you're not gonna attack my mining outpost, you evil pirates. Desert World? Okay, Desert World. Yeah, definitely. Something like that. I know... I think that's our first Kerbal Death, isn't it? I think it's our first Kerbal Death. Maybe I should wait for reinforcements. Hold on, guys. Station we'll wait for that time. fourth fleet to come. Spaceborne life forms, which the Kerbal Head of Society research has come to refer to as Tianki, 
are docile creatures capable of accessing some lower dimension of subspace. They roam from system to system with relative ease, though nearly the same ease as Kerbal fleets. They graze on gases common to the upper layers of many gas giants. It is highly unlikely to say the least that this is their only food source, but intake of other nutrients has yet to be observed. They will rarely, if ever, attack. These are the docile ones, by the way. Uh, even when provoked, they can be safely ignored. Okay. Oh, we must defend our station, I think. Construction. All right. The fourth fleet just couldn't come in in time. First fleet under Danlock Kerman, who has uh, extra ship hull points, is gonna approach. Hostile fleet in and attack Boblin Kerman. Looking good. Will the pirate scourge be wiped out? Is this the only pirate, uh, only pirate faction around? Situation log updated. Okay, let's let's do these things. We need to research that project. You research that one, please. Uh, construction ship. We are going to build that station. All right. Now we need more funds, we need more energy credits. Where else can we build? Uh, actually that const oh, that was in the construction ship anyway. Um, wow, there's a lot of uh, stuff to- oh, these are the special- okay, so some of it is- okay, we, we have a lot of research to do. We need to build more science ships. Build science ships. Yeah, two more is fine. Um, construction ship. Uh, that one already has a station. Let's build a research station around Rim 4. Okay, science ship. Okay, so we've got that science ship. But we need a scientist. Let's recruit another scientist. Dude file Kerman. Expertise in computing, research speed materials. Uh, well, they're not really specialists in this sort of thing, but let's get one that, uh, that at least is young. Okay. So the Minmus 15. And we need to go to Rim. And we want to investigate the insidious Nirin. Why does it only move here? Oh, we might need a higher level scientist. Oh. I think we need a higher level scientist to do that. Yeah, I'm going to switch out Dorod Kerman. Hold on. Mm. Dorod Kerman. And assign Damal Kerman there. Yeah. Over here. Um, I want a science lab there. I want more science. You're playing it right now. Well, there you go. Uh, playing stars together? Well, let me get my feet wet, but uh, yeah, I think multiplayer is a possibility, but only after I've really fleshed this out. I'm uh, doing this as part of a YouTube series as well, so, you know, once once I've taken this to its logical conclusion, whatever that might happen to be, then, then yeah. Rocketry, yes! Jenkin, Ker Jenkin Kerman, research speed rocketry, yes, we want you. I don't care if that's not the right place to put you. We need you. Um, let's have you... S uh, I, I want to continue exploring, though. We haven't surveyed that. We haven't surveyed that. We need to continue surveying things. Oh, uh, that one's pretty much in our territory, is it? Um, not really. Let me make sure I've researched everything. Yeah, this one is in our territory. Oh, we've researched that already. I want to make sure we've done everything that is in our territory. See, this one is in our territory, but we haven't surveyed yet. Okay, so you survey that system. You can survey that one. We still don't have too many, uh, which got colonizable worlds, is the problem. Okay, you build one there. 
And you build one there. Can I name a colony after? Oh, sure. Well, uh, maybe not a colony, Lego clone, but uh, how about Black Hole? Can we rename the Black Hole? No, we can't rename. Oh, oh, yeah, we can. Okay. Do you want a Black Hole or not? You tell me. I I, I want to make sure that you actually want a Black Hole. For more map info, it might be easier to. Okay. Uh, where? Toggle this one? Oh, okay, good. Um, Leif Ocean World? Oh, good, good, thank you. Uh, you wanted a Tundra World, not an Arctic, right? Oh, there's a Tundra World. Here we go. I guess we can't rename it unless it's in our territory. Well, once we get over there, we will rename it for you. Surma 2. Okay, that one's in transit, that one's in transit, this one's doing stuff. Okay, Acmail. I want you to build a frontier outpost. Yeah, influence is hard to come by. Uh, we only have one frontier outpost so far, so it's not too bad. But we've got a colony in New Kerbal here, and uh, we've got the home here. I'm wondering if Vacradil is now safe or not. Evading hostile fleet. Is it? Uh, okay, where's the hostile fleet? Oh, stupid space amoeba. Okay, let's get our Fegor fleet together. And attack those guys. Because we definitely want that system. We need to get them together so that Danlock Kerman's in charge of all of them. Research complete. Haven't discovered yet in relation to sectors is whether or not you can build a frontier outpost and assign it to a sector. Anomaly whether or not found. that eliminates the influence cost. Hmm. Good question. Oh, that's a tough failure risk. Standing the star unveils a small object in rapid orbit. Its small size and high velocity makes it difficult for our sensors to isolate. Well, definitely research that. Okay, now military fleet. Head to act mail. Looks like our construction ship is fine there. Despite the space amoeba. Despite the space amoeba. Okay. Special project complete. Snirens are large burrowing creatures that live beneath the dunes of the vast equatorial deserts on KSP Minmus 15. When these predators sense movement on the sand above, they immediately raise dozens of tall spikes from their backs in the hope of impaling something edible. Sounds marvelous. Finding a suitable specimen proved difficult at first until hundreds of tracked remote-controlled drones were dispatched across the desert in random directions. This led to the discovery and procurement of an unusually large specimen that had grown more than a hundred spikes on its back. Okay, well, we've got some, some research there. Never research them unless the fail probability is less than- Well, we're Kerbals. Yeah, yeah. Well, we're Kerbals. We can't- We can't risk the possibility of not getting the research. Oh, uh, speaking of which. Mining drone laser. Oh, fusion reactors. I want fusion reactors. Your scientists can die? Well, they're Kerbals. Okay, the probability conundrum. We have gotten a report from science officer Jenkin Kerman. It seems that a ceramic container... I mean, that's their job. Their job is to science and risk their lives sciencing, right? Ceramic container is circling the star Hanrel... Han... Hanary. Most peculiar. It should obviously not be there, yet somehow it has managed to find its way into a close orbit. Project that has a time, you can always come back later. Yeah, 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 but these are Kerbals. <laughs> uh, we have to roleplay a little bit here. I mean, if I'm gonna say that I'm going to be a Kerbal... Kerbals in Stellaris, I better play Kerbals in Stellaris. A uh, special project can be issued to investigate the container and try to deduce how it ended up there. Otherwise, they just like look like Kerbals, but they don't act like Kerbals, and that's not right. Ooh, influence gained. Well, you guys would say that I should get that. All questions don't have worthwhile answer, answers, but 
I definitely think uh, the Kerbals would say uh, conundrum worth investigating. Situation log updated. We must investigate. Hostile fleet detected. Okay, where are you? Oh, more space amoeba. Uh, wait, where are you going, space amoeba? Our fleet is right there. They're going to our home? No way. Oh wait, though they just disappeared. I don't know. Hostile fleet. Oh, they, they are. They're trying to go to Kerbal. Attack them. Defend the home world. And then we'll uh, send it over to this Maragdis. Maragdis. Hostile fleet engaged. System survey complete. Okay, survey of Olam 4 has revealed that certain regions of the planet are home to a primitive alien proto civilization. Our probes show that the Neolithic culture has mastered fire and developed a rudimentary spoken language, but we have yet to see any evidence of metallurgy or written communications. So, is it one of those cases where we should establish uh, some sort of thing there? Oh, we can't colonize the world because of Xenon. Well, we don't have desert colonization anyway, but we could get some science. Science ship. Uh, well, no, we need a construction ship. Uh, we can't build... Oh, it's not within our borders. Shoot. We could get some serious science out of that. Oh, well, go to that system. Uh, first fleet? Yes. Battle. Space amoeba, always making things hard on us. Build an observation station? There, it's not within our borders. Oh, a warp drive, but that's only because the Kerbal uh, preset had warp drive. I wanted hyperdrive, but I couldn't pick hyperdrive. What? The hostile fleet now. We've got ancient mining drones and military... Okay, just go there, clean up. I'm sick of these guys. We must be able to science. It is imperative. Okay, science ship. Well, go to... Go to Rim and... Or, uh, is Smyrma something interesting? Oh yeah, malleable goo... Whatever those goo things are. Yeah, uh, no, I want to see what's going on there. Okay, yes, you. Construction complete. They're ancient mining drones, and they're... There's this mining station. It's a close call, but I think we're gonna make it here. We lost two ships, though. Okay, wow, just barely survived that. Alright. Um, he really needs to heal. But I want to take on that guy. Okay, now, well, now we've got Spaceport Level 3. Destroyer Assembly Yard. Plasma Thrusters. Mass Driver. I want a Mass Driver. But we've got the wrong Kerbal in charge of it. Um, hold on. Okay. Yay, destroyers. Oh, uh, we lost another ship. It seems like we're losing. Leader trait unyielding disables emergency FTL. Well, that's not handy. I hope he knows what he's doing. Gulantha herd secured. Gulantha is a large uh, flat herbivores that have evolved internal gas pockets, enabling them to hover a few centimeters above the ground. They move about in herds consisting of a few dozen animals, grazing on the moss and lichen that can be found on the windswept plains of KSP Minmus 15. Why is everything KSP Minmus 15? No, uh, that's not right. Uh, it's got a problem. It's KSP Mimus 15 is the ship that's investigating it. Uh, something about the coding of this is picking up the ship name instead of the planet name. 
They are ruthless, ruthlessly hunted by the something's apex predators. And our biologists on the apex, uh, KSP minus 15, that's right, estimate that only a few hundred Galantha herds remain. One of these, consisting of nine animals, have been successfully collected and will be brought back to Kerbin. Okay. Uh, well, we should pay attention to the battle. Looks like Danlock Kerman is turning the tide a bit, hopefully. This is a tough battle. But it looks like we're on the verge of winning. It's really not it's right for me to leave. Updated. Okay, all right. So I want a science ship immediately to come over here and survey this system. Survey system. All right. So that's good. And maybe okay. That's debris. What what are the other things that we need to observe? Um, alien specimen procurement. Okay, we've completed those two. Um, beer four. Go to. I'll have a science ship uh, research that one. Ravenous Zulcor we can't get to. These are very valuable by the way. We don't have border access to those, but this one we do go to. It's riding Kerbal, okay. So uh, we'll have uh, this ship research that one. If you hold down the shift key, you can tell the ship to do multiple actions. Okay, I'll remember that. But just for my own organization, I like to keep it one at a time. Um, we still haven't put a station around New Kerbal 5A. Fleet detected. Oh, where is that now? Oh, the space amoeba. Evading hostile fleet. Dang it! Yeah, the problem with uh, doing uh, a lot of actions is then their actions get cancelled whenever they encounter a hostile fleet. So that sort of changes things. Uh, we need to build more ships. Hold on a sec. Um, ship designer. Now we can build destroyers. Oh, you guys are telling me, okay, so uh, what what can we add? Okay, solar panel network, you think? Energy credits? Okay, solar panel network. Corvette assembly yards. Observatory, I think the observatory will be good. Physics output, society output, for our capital, I think that's good. Okay, so that's that. Can we build a spaceport here? Yeah, definitely. We should do that. Surface-wise, can we upgrade? No, that's the wrong one. Upgrade, no, planetary administration we can't do just yet. We don't have enough population. Okay, so now let's build a destroyer. Okay, new design. Destroyer. Okay, our first section, Fortune Breaker. I want the... I, let, let, let's do big guns. Faith Breaker. And then uh, we'll, we'll go with the big, big weapon sort of thing. Go big or go home. Nuclear missiles. Not really guns. Okay. Let's see. Everything else is top-notch. We only have fission reactors. We're researching fusion reactors right now. Okay, that has balanced power. We've got shields. And uh, we've got damage. Okay, so what class of ship is this? Uh, well, I mean, we'll call it the... Uh... Oh, Bronco has a nice name. Uh, Bronco class. Okay, so Bronco class. Uh, we should have better... A better Gecko class as well. Oh, we need a level 3 upgrade too. Let's build a better Gecko class. Let's start that off. 
Okay, I'm gonna update the gecko class. So that... Oh, it's... Yeah, okay, it's already got that. Oh, okay. Research complete. So that's fine. Research! Oh, that's a good one. That gives us extra influence. Alright, amoeba flagella? Hostile fleet detected. Uh, hmm. I don't know about this one. That's pretty powerful, it looks like. But H. Regenerative hull tissue, wow. We should get him to do that, though. But, yeah, yeah, we'll have to get him to do that. But we could start out. That's re that's rare. Yeah, legendary science. Rare science. Yeah, so we'll do the regenerative hull tissue. Regenerative hull tissue sucks? Research complete. Aw, really? Nano composite armor, I, I know I, I want that. Yeah. H for hangar. So that's not mounted on a ship then? I mean, how does that work? Hangar, I haven't seen hangar before. Okay, physics, whoops. Disruptor, red laser. Red shard thrower, how about red shard thrower, any good? Yeah, I just got to it, Arthur. Any good uh, red shard thrower is another thing. Anomaly found. Initial analysis of the asteroid's composition towards points towards potentially interesting finds. Okay, research. Red crystal capacitors. Physics lab? Quantum theory sounds good, but I've got this rare one. Maybe it'll just take too long to do a rare one, though. I'll get the physics lab first, okay. But dang it, I need to get some of these rare technology. But then again, uh, should our, my society person really be working on regenerative hull tissue? Oh, well, oh, um, I, I was supposed to do that research. Ah, such thoughts. I don't want to clear a mountain range. Biolab, probably you would say that biolab is the thing I should do, right? Alright. Seems so boring, but okay. 